Salami Stadium here in the city of Ibadan. The largest city in West Africa, of course, if the history is three correct. And today it's a crown taken on by Elsa. United, the weatherman says it's 37 degrees. And of course, we're going to have a very interesting encounter here. And Abubakar uh, Yakubu Hassan is the match commissioner, and he comes from Plati State. Uh, it's a civil servant from the Ministry of Sports in that state, and uh, he's the one leading the players out onto the battle uh, pitch uh, theater, so we call it. And that's uh, Crown Football Club against Bayelsa. The two teams have never met before because in 2010-2011, when Bayelsa went not too uh, good for them. In recent times, a troubled team and uh, a lot uh, have been expected for them to salvage a four-match losing streak if not won in four matches. Another uh, promoted side. Four loss here. But uh, Bayelsa regaining it. Now they're trying to make it move. Ukrawanta. And a chance. It is equalizer for Bayelsa United. They've been stretching all the while. And now nothing can stop them. They get the equalizer. He's uh, satisfied. Wonderful football here. As soon as he got it, he chipped it on the path of Grimpong. And Eric Grimpong saw it, saw Peter Dimo Bowie. Peter had all the time in the world. He trapped the ball and ballooned out into the net. But then Grimpong showed vision. He did not hurry, he took his time, found his man, and of course, his man then ballooned that ball into the net for the equalizer by Peter Dimo Bowie. And it's a uh, crown one by Elsa and United. The first round with a win here at home. Fortune to put it. Blowing cord in this second half. The chance come in, and it is there. Uh, it's the equalizer finally for Bayelsa United. It's a Bimbo Bowie with his brace here. And his ninth goal of the season. He will go in as a top scorer so far in the season. A Bimbo Bowie, very prolific scorer. Wonderful header from him. And it is by us a leveling things. I was just thinking about the level like comedy, if it will. And it is surely now. Peter Bimoboe has done it for Bayelsa. Oh, the crown doing in there. The sort of exposed goal to Baraji, Abdul Latif in all of this. And he could only stand and watch the far header of Peter Bimoboe slip into the far corner of the net. I'm still at a loss of what to explain the whereabouts of the defenders. Of, I'm talking about Ibe Christian as well as Omotuku Benson to the chagrin of coach Lorenzo Fakona. Leko and Francis. For crown, a bit of away with a brace. It's crown two and by Elsa two and game on. Reverse that and uh, move them to Benin instead. So they are the home side here today as uh, the formalities have gone through. Rangers uh, not exactly going great guns yet in the season and by Elsa United uh, not doing much better. But uh, good for them. They have three games on Rangers in terms of uh, backlog and uh, so those are. Oh, Huge difference yes. inside the mid-table uh, he will be looking at uh, grabbing his first full away point here today. That's uh, the bad guy as far as uh, Bielsa United are concerned in a fourth position. Peter Bimo Boy, he scored uh, twice this season and that's uh, the two goals that secured a 2 0 win at uh, City Rivals, Nimbe City. He is uh, one to watch out for. A player hugely talented, he gets among the goals frequently, but several times uh, his uh, career has uh, been blighted by injury. So he will be one to look out for here today. A, a man who knows what to do when he gets the ball in the final. Uh, he doesn't do much. Still Rangers. And somehow, for some reason, you wonder what uh, Justice Chinadu was doing. He turned his back on, his, uh, on the attacker, and uh, he, that would be entirely his fault if anything were to result from that. Rangers. Oh, what a goal there! What a goal that was! From a totally impossible angle, Peter Edimo Bowie, that's we've been talking about him. That's why he's the gentleman there. That's why everybody has been expecting him to deliver. And what an impossible angle from what we had to do it. That's entirely Justice Chinadu's fault that uh, I'm sure by United I said, don't mind. It's a hefty lead now for them. <laughs> Very hefty lead indeed, but I don't know if we go to choose as the better one. Is this a ladder cross finish or this one? Because it did, say, it, it did seem that uh, a Bimo boy had lost the chance after beating the goalkeeper. He did seem lost for ideas, but he simply found space to squeeze that one into the back of the net. 
you can watch here, he beats the goalkeeper, really turns, slows down, kills the ball, looks up and plants that into the back of the net. That's the way you want to finish. And this is a hallmark of a deadly a striker. He looks as if he wanted to pass to a, a, a teammate, but uh, he just found some space to squeeze that in. Again, Rangers uh, tentatively defending. Wonderful pass coming from Eric Green from there. The goalkeeper came across, doesn't get there. He is beaten. And how about that for a turn? And he finishes with a plum. Fantastic goal, 3-1 by Elsa United.